A Neighborhood Appreciation Day takes place in Manchester. Grace Rivera brings us some of the event's details. Let's take a look. Welcome to Victoria Park in Manchester. Nearly 18 months of COVID restrictions. And now here we are, finally getting back to some level of normality. On the 19th of July, the UK government initiated the fourth step of the roadmap out of lockdown, including the end of social restrictions. Today, we are joining a Neighbourhood Appreciation Day organized by the Iglesia Ni Cristo in collaboration with Friends of Victoria Park. The uh, Neighbourhood Appreciation Cleanup Day in this park, in the community, in Manchester, is a very important event or activity that is being conducted and sponsored by the Iglesia Ni Cristo or the Church of Christ. Members of the church from all ages have traveled to participate in this activity to help out in cleaning up this park um, in uh, Manchester. It's important to give back to the community and us being here today, we are doing our part, we're helping clean up, we're helping to make a better environment for people to socialize in. It's important for me to be here today because it's a good thing to serve our community. We're very excited to participate in this event uh, because it is uh, the first activity that is held in person since uh, the easing of uh, most of the lockdown restrictions here in England. We were given the task to look after the brethren to gather here in Victoria Park to help in maintaining our neighborhood at the same time as um, protecting, safeguarding the brethren in attendance today. families and friends are given tasks to help update some areas of the park such as washing down of the kids playground, weeding and litter picking to mention a few. A generous act of contribution was also made by the church as a picnic table and chairs are being built to be donated to the park as a memorial gesture of this collaborative project. My name is Shelley Quinton Hume and I'm the chairperson for the Friends of Victoria Park in Stratford, which is in Manchester. It's wonderful. Our group relies on volunteers to help make the park as beautiful as it is. So it's great to have you guys here carrying out some work that we can't get done. So having a big group of you coming is a great help. In the UK at the moment, funding for parks is really low and the pandemic has shown that people are using parks far more than they've ever done before. And so it's really important that volunteers help keep the parks nice so that people can still enjoy them, especially in times of pandemic. The wake of the pandemic has left the public reluctant and apprehensive to help with communities like this. The sense of uncertainty and worry is still in most people's minds. This community gathering indicates a promising change in the way the pandemic has gripped the world. This project is a timely opportunity for groups and individuals to act as an essential part of society, working together towards a better ecological sustainability. It's really very important for members of the Church of Christ to conduct activities like this uh, so that we can fulfill one of the commandments of our Lord God, that we perform acts of kindness to our fellow men, especially during this time of pandemic. Okay. Um, now that I've been here and I've done my part, you know, it's, it's a tiring feeling, I can't, I can't lie, but you know, it's fulfilling in a sense. A true mark of humanity 
in these times of global uncertainty by the members of the Iglesia Ni Cristo. What an amazing day! I'm Grace Rivera, reporting for Eagle News, United Kingdom. We live!